Hi, is what I like to be at all times of the day. Hello and welcome to episode 19 of the BJ Report. I'm your host, Bard, and with me, Jerry. Jericho. Hello. 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 Long hello. time. It's been a while. It's, it's, been, a while. A while. it's, it's been, been a while. while. It's been a while. It's been a while. <laughs> so, from climate change to the Rust film set tragedy to the Astro uh, Festival disaster and to a baby's first word being mask, welcome to the BJ Report, uh, where we try to dissect and analyze news articles from around the world for, with the sole purpose of learning nothing at all. Jerry, how are you? Surviving, boss. Surviving? Same old shit, different day. You know Same how old shit, different day. You know how it is, man. We're, we're out here grafting, grinding in the corporate world. In the corporate world. Corporate today, slavery and all that. Absolutely. Yeah, I mean, well, ah. we've got our guest uh, for today. Uh, we have a return of Iqbal. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. How are you? I'm good, guys. He's I'm good. Hair. He's Thanks for having hair. me again. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've actually have hair this time, as you can see, guys. <laughs> How much did the transplant co- cost? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Um, I don't wish I had a transplant, um, but I don't have that much money, unfortunately. Fortunately, I'm Fair a broke enough. out here, mate. <laughs> <Fair> <laughs> and um, we've got actually a second guest on the show, a first time special. Um, James, yeah, thanks for having How me on the show. You? Yeah, it's very stand good. up, tell the people what you I'm stand for. Get, I am not getting <laughs> to say anything. Don't even bother. Don't even as bother. You, as you can see, we've done a bit of an update. We've actually got a professional studio now that we're working with. Just to, the, yeah. just to increase the quality for who? For you guys. For, for to you. learn nothing. For you guys. <laughs> <laughs> to learn nothing. <laughs> to learn nothing. <laughs> I beg you to talk wow. to him. I beg you to come out. Let's get out. <laughs> <laughs> can't find this guy. I can't find a door, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, because we've got more guests on the show now, we're going to keep it just to one article. It's an interesting article that um, myself and Jerry have sourced that we thought would be very interesting to, to, to discuss. Uh, I'm going to hand it over to Jerry. Jerry, do you want to read out? Just a, just a headline <laughs> to begin with. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you're laughing. This is ridiculous, bro. <laughs> Listen, let's get it's, straight it's, to it's, it. It's, 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 it's pretty I think decent. It's, I, I think it's a good one. I think it's funny, to be fair. Let's so, go. Child Genius is is reborn Martian. He's a reborn Martian. Sorry, what? <laughs> 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 we hey, hey, let, let the man finish. Uh, let's, 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 let's hear it. Let's hear it. Have a, okay. have, have, a, have a listen to this. Child genius is a reborn Martian sent to warn us of nuclear apocalypse. Yeah. So yeah, Boriska. <laughs> <laughs> Boriska. Okay. Well, well, shit demonstrated then. a remarkable grasp of scientific and astronomical concepts and said he knows so much because in the previous life he lived on Mars. <laughs> hey, let's, rank, let's respect the kid. <laughs> now let's respect the kid. Bear in mind, he's only fourteen. What? Sorry, what? So he's a genius at the age of fourteen. Yeah, he was. So he's a genius, and he's he's still alive, Jerry. I mean, he is. Yeah, <laughs> no, he's alive. Wait, yeah. So, so, who, so wait, wait. Who, <laughs> who classified this guy as a genius? Who? As oh, in his local village. I'm just talking about <laughs> professors and scholars. <laughs> exactly. well, his local village. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So no, he, so let, 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 let's read on from it. So from an early age, he's been telling people about his previous life on Mars, mm. where he lived among alien civilization. Okay. <laughs> and <laughs> oh and lived, also lived through a nuclear cat- catos- catastrophe. 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 Sorry, because I'm getting... Oh, you know, catastrophe. I'm catastrophe. from fucking... Because I'm from Albania, Kosovo. I'm from Kosovo. So this is what he says. He says he was a pilot among the aliens and he travelled to Earth in 1996. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then was reborn as a human child and wants the yeah. warn of the upcoming battle. Mm. Sounds interesting still. Yeah, so I found a separate ar- ar- article about the same person written a few days uh, at, at the same time. So he's made some predictions. So okay. first of all, what do you think of the concept of Someone claiming they're being reborn. So the, the, this guy, he's a certified genius in terms of academically what he knows. So he yeah. goes up against professors and scholars and they 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 get baffled by him. What do you think of the concept of this person that's considered a genius saying that he's being reborn? Do you believe in reincarnation? Yeah, f- firstly, what's your thoughts on, um, <laughs> <laughs> on, on aliens? I'm curious to hear from you. What do you mean? <laughs> Why are you looking at me? Yeah, me. Yeah, what me. What what is on is from him. Do you know on, what? On, Do you know what? Aliens. It's gonna it's gonna sound mad, yeah. I actually <laughs> I think aliens exist in it, so that's just my opinion. <laughs> oh. I, I generally feel like they do still. Why? Okay. 
There's just enough evidence to prove well, that. Where? 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 Where's, Where's this oh, evidence? Here we go. Here we go. Like stuff you love, bro. Fucking fight. That doesn't fight. even fight. What do you mean? Stuff for love. Stuff for love. <laughs> There's oh, evidence God. everywhere. Okay. The world's not crashing 47. Do you not know about that? So what? You know what? I'm about, about to get mad on the podcast right no, now. Crash 47. <laughs> what? what does that even what mean? What do you mean there was a crash in 47, boss? <laughs> what? What's this? Do you guys know what crash? UFO. UFO. It's going to get a bit more mad if we talk about aliens. You know, the royal So you understand like, was it Area 51? Th- that exists. Th- that yeah, that exists. Really but they moved them out of their time ago, boss. People find out about Area Fifty One. They moved to another section. You guys don't know about stuff. <laughs> do you know about Ho- Do you know about Hollow Earth and all this stuff? You know? So what? Hollow yeah. Earth. Hollow Earth. Yeah, it's conspiracy theory. Yeah. What does that even mean? What is what? There's people Earth underneath need... us, boss. Be- because Not outside. J- James there. believes in five G. <laughs> so... Oh wait, actually, James. Real question. Yeah, yeah. Go, Did go you on. get the vaccination? Yes or no? Oh, are you trying to expose me? <laughs> oh, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> That's a simple question. No, no, listen, that, yeah. listen, put it this no. way. Yeah? Oh, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> he actually put believes in 5G. I, listen, I didn't get the vaccination, yeah? But I've met people that were double vax, right? Mm-hmm. And you lot are still getting sick. Yeah. Did they turn into the, Martians by any chance? They, listen, <laughs> not, not yet. It's not yet. Boris but, <laughs> listen, yeah. They, they literally said you have to start getting booster every six months. Did you know, do you know about oh, that? To be fair, yeah. I did get the email <laughs> from the NHS saying, your booster is overdue. But I feel great. So I don't know if I was... That's what booster? I'm trying to say. Why do you need a booster? Like, I, like, I haven't taken none of the vaccine and I'm still fine for a whole year. So, wow. listen, it's up to you guys. So what about it? the people that have been unvaxxed and have passed away? Yeah. Well, the people that have been vaxxed have still passed away. Do you know how pissed you, I'm going to be? If you've been... But who do you think the statistically is more? Because now we've gone into vaccinations. I want to talk about... Uh, aliens and and reincarnation, but just briefly summarize. In terms of stats, why do you think more people who are unvaxxed are dying compared to the people that are vaxxed? Just out of curiosity, I don't know, I mean, yeah, but stupid. like the, the, the real question, like where you get <laughs> where where are you getting these numbers from? Though? Is, is it numbers that you know the numbers you're being no, told? I saw this uh, number on the Sudoku because <laughs> you know it's a nine by nine grid. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, did you know, yeah? Like, okay, you know what? People probably, probably already know this. Like, let's say you got hit by a car, yeah? Stuck for a lot. Yeah, I'm just saying, touch wood, didn't it? You got hit by a car and you were like, vac- let's say you had COVID two weeks ago. If yeah. you got if you got hit by a car two weeks after, yeah. your cause of death would be put down as, as by COVID. No, all, in, in is- some cases, no way. I can back that up, actually. Oh, he's so, no, no, because my my um my auntie, she, she died of cancer. Yeah. Oh, and, yeah, no, I swear. Yeah, yeah, like the no, no, wait, let's clarify this. Igbo laughs at awkward situations. Yeah, yeah, awkward situations. Yeah. Yeah. He laughs, so look, I understand. Yeah, that. I've known him for a while. So yeah, she died of cancer, <laughs> and it's just a bit mad. <laughs> He's actually laughing. This guy's a fucking prick. That's a bit weird. Yeah, that's probably weird. Guys, FYI, I have a condition. I think it's called Joker syndrome. Yeah, I don't mean it in any sort of way. No, you're just a donkey. Yeah, he's a fucking bald prick. I know, but. Yeah, yeah, she died of cancer and um, it was expensive in Philippines to, to try and... <laughs> <laughs> to try and take the cancer out. Yo, yeah, fuck this guy. This guy's Muslim and he's drinking alcohol. Oh, oh, no! Hey, yeah, you you got me the you're the expensive drink. Wow. Oh. Oh. You're no. surrounded by 4K cameras and you're telling me you're trying to hide it from there to there. But no, hold on. To get to back... Uh, I'm guessing they put down the cause of your auntie's death as COVID because they probably get money from it. No, they get funds from it. Yeah, exactly. Oh, really? Yeah, they get, they yeah. get funds oh, from really? it. Oh, really? You didn't know that. You just yeah, found out now. <laughs> it, was, it was expensive. Yeah, I swear. It was expensive to, <laughs> to obviously, the hospital bills and everything was expensive, yeah. but you can sign it off if you claim the you know, reason of death was COVID. Yeah. So there's an ulterior motive to yeah, kill boss. people you know, off. Yeah. Yeah. That's COVID. why I'm not getting the vaccine. I'm joking. I've had it. I will have them every... If they told me once a week I have to have them, I'll fucking... But look, out. look. Without a doubt, if we were to go on holiday, like when I went to Saudi Arabia, for instance, yeah, yeah. when you, uh, I had well, to. Hold take... on, just out of curiosity, yeah. why, why did you go to Saudi Arabia? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Why are you exposing this? <laughs> oh no, you guys got me in the trap. <laughs> Holiday. It was a family holiday. Uh, yeah, yeah. Was, it? Go... was it? Is it? Yeah, we went quad biking, camel riding. Did you drink riding. on the plane? <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> Zamza Mota, but oh, Zamza Mota. Yeah, yeah. Alhamdulillah. Uh, okay, cool, cool. So you went, you went to Saudi Arabia to obviously cleanse yourself of sins. Basically, yeah. Because two weeks later, we were in a pub <laughs> and we wanted to go casino. Yeah, do you want me to expose you? That time you went to Mecca, boss. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh my God. We're, we're okay. going off on a tangent, lad. Oh, yeah, we are. We are going off on a tangent. All right, okay, fair enough. So, wait, wait, let, finish, let him finish. His yeah, point. so when you go on to like exotic holidays or go Saudi Arabia, for instance, even yeah. though it's not exotic, 
we have to take something, uh, well, we have to take a travel vaccine. So for this instance, it was the yellow fever. I've never heard of this fever before, mm -hmm. but I took it without a doubt. Loads of people take these kind of vaccinations yeah. when they go on holiday. Absolutely. So what's the difference between that and taking a COVID jab? We're going to let our expert in the COVID field, James, answer that. James, <laughs> Listen, I am not an expert in any way, <laughs> shape or form. No, but you're not answering the question. But if you were to go on holiday right now mm -hmm. to an exotic country, let's say Thailand, for instance, I could almost guarantee you have to take some sort well, yeah, of vaccination. That's the thing. Would you take the vax? Would you take the vaccination? I, if, if the incentive is for me to take the vaccine to travel, I still won't take it. I won't. I no, but you have to. But oh, you're so, you're take the... so your holiday is literally from Peckham to Croydon. That's it. That, that's <laughs> and like Bromley. And and Bromley. Oh, yeah, Bromley. That's a bit. Not, listen, Deep South. It, listen, in a way, they're trying to like make people like forcefully take take these kind of things in it that's, oh, that's what I've, that's I've what actually I like. you know what you've got a point because I've read an article funny enough yesterday when Austria if you take the vaccination you get a bloody um, escort service oh yeah a free get of your choice yeah, for 30 yeah. minutes no, I read free that, read that I read that to Barney yesterday basically and I'm not gonna lie the girl that was on that shoot for the newspapers was fucking fit uh, well, I will happily take my jabs and this is what I mean like they're making <laughs> they're providing these silly incentives yeah so we, you can take it like this okay. is this is the one time they've actually pushed people taking vaccine okay. how many years have we had the flu and everything like they, they haven't forced anyone yeah, to take true. all these stuff so but like they do, they do have a flu jab which the, well there is a flu jab but it's not composed that's like, what i'm trying to say like yeah because the flu because covid is way stronger than the flu mm. don't give me don't get flu like symptoms confused with it's the flu it's and not. i'm not trying to upset anyone who's like parents no, or anything no, no. has passed away but like it's like a i'm just saying like i just i personally won't take it fair enough but here we are we've gotten to in uh, onto now a debate about conspiracy theories so to get back to the main article with uh what this kid is saying so yeah. he's saying that there's different types of pr predictions that he's made one of them so the, the the subheading for this is secret of the sphinx so the the mm. pyramids okay yeah they he said the great uh, sphinx of egypt holds secret that when uncovered will change life on earth forever he said his species has a strong connection to the ancient egyptians and that he flew there in his previous life as a spaceship pilot on mars Bar Bariska, who calls himself an indigo child, says life on Earth will never be the same again when the secrets of the mysterious monument in Giza are finally unlocked. He sounds more high than anyone else. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Mate, listen, I'm I, not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. Listen, it Loki kind of proved my point earlier. Do you remember when I told you about all the crashing that? So if he was a previous pilot in his recent years Ooh. and they were flying Ooh. around. Oh, Ooh. you see that? Okay. So they've been traveling here for ages, boss. But hold on, hold on. I, I would just say for the record that I, I, I think, obviously... All conspiracy theorists and all mumbo jumbo like this is utter, utter shit. But I'm very curious to hear, obviously, what you guys think. That's why I invite, uh, obviously, uh, Iqbal and stupid people. But you like know Jim. what? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm I joking, always I'm... had this point. Like, who came up with the, the conspiracy theories in the first place? Like that terminology in itself. Mm -hmm. Because I don't think there has you to be know an what? element of truth. There to has everything, to be an element there's of truth. An element of truth to it. It sure. may not be the full truth, but there is an element of truth. So I don't think that there's aliens out there. I think there's a superior power. Absolutely. Well, we, me and Jerry have spoken. What this do you mean by show superior power? You yeah, sound yeah. bare like smart, but what do you mean? Do you yeah, so <laughs> can, can I can, can I just uh, interject like at this point? Me and Jerry have spoken this in the previous podcast. So we were going back and forth whether aliens exist or not. Now, aliens in the term as we know it, not like some fucking space invaders or you know the little crisps. The crisps. Crisp. <laughs> the crisp. They don't. They don't oh, come yeah. in that sort of head shape. It's not how. Hollywood I, will make it sound. No, I, I it think does. I, does no, life outside of us exist somewhere? I believe so. Yeah, hundred percent. Is it in the form that we think it is? Absolutely not. So I think it's so. Un, uh, it's so you know what? Has anyone ever thought about us. this? They could actually be in human form, but they might be no, like. No, no, that, that's 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 another one. They, that's they the reptilians. They, the reptilians, yeah, the reptilians. They can that's look right. Like you. They look like us, but there's some. Obviously, it, it's it's obvious. They can't remain human form for a long period, period. of time. Yeah. So therefore, they that's why you only see Ellen for twenty yeah. minutes on a show, boss. Oh, they <laughs> that's that's shit. I'm joking. Yeah, they merge between <laughs> their reptilian form and human form. Yeah, but like, when you mean reptilian, as in like they, they become like an animal. No, no, they look, no, they, they look they reptilian. They've got scales creatures. and shit. Yeah. yeah. Okay, could you give an example of so a person that's famous? No, there, there's like one. Um, I, I can't remember whose conference it was. I think it was oh, was it Obama's. Maybe. He was there. He was stood as security. 
There's, there's an image of, of him. Oh, really? He looked, he didn't look human. He was, he had like the arms and legs and everything, but fi- his facial features were not human at all. Uh, oh. No, and what do you think of the concept of clones in that? Do you know how many like all these famous no, rappers yeah. go to prison? They came back. They don't even look the same anymore. Oh, oh. no, no, no! Oh, oh my fucking hell, James! No, James, James. Listen, you are knee right deep in <laughs> fucking <laughs> theories. Clones. You went clones down a rabbit hill. hole. <laughs> You, you know went, you went on the computer. They dropped the bar of soap, bro. <laughs> and they got tooted. <laughs> They're traumatized. Like, literally, boss. yeah, they got traumatized. That's what happened. They got this happened. cherry bomb in there. <laughs> no, no, no. That, 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 that's, that's let's get back to this. this but let's, boy. Yeah, let's get back to this kid. Yeah. Let's get back to this kid. So He's a genius. Another one is global flooding. Yeah. So then he oh. talks about two major uh, incidences that never materialized on the dates that he said he would. In 2009, two years after he made mm. the video, he said there will be a. Uh, a great disaster on one of the large continents followed by another in 2013. These events were supposed to have been flooding, which he said would have affected the whole world, leaving relative hu- well, relatively few humans alive. So he- here's, here's the problem, obviously, with something like an article like this. So it captures you. You read it, obviously. It's a topic of discussion now on the podcast. Yeah. So he's made two previous predictions that haven't come true. Do you know what I would do if I was the journalist or the person writing the article? I'd be like, is that what he said? Yeah, tell him to fuck off. <laughs> yeah, yeah? yeah. How old is he? Fourteen. <laughs> yeah, tell him to learn how to wank first. Yeah, to go do go do something he, normal. He says he's twenty four. No, it's just no, fourteen. He's fourteen. He's fourteen. Yeah. He's 14. Oh my god. Go and, what, go what's his IQ level? Job. Is it the same as Einstein? It's better than yours. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not too sure exactly. <laughs> what uh, a bastard. <laughs> uh, he claims all Martians, so all people like him, and all Martians are immortal, and they stop aging. At 35. Oh, good news for you. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> it's not good news for me, mate. Oh, for, <laughs> clearly you, not. You've got, you've got one more year left. And then you stop aging. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah. Your, stomach, your, your stomach's on so fire. So we man. could travel in time, space, um, around these spaceships, but we would observe life on Earth on triangular aircrafts. So would you believe, obviously, let's say it, let's say <gasps> this space is... Triangular. Tri- tri- it's Concord. Really Concord is there. Concord was triangular. But that's been... <gasps> it was... And when did it stop? 1996, the year he was born. No, I'm joking. Don't uh, you? No, no. no. <laughs> Look at it for space. <laughs> it was like, oh, shit. No, oh, shit. No, no, but Concord's yeah. been out for how long? Yeah, Years. but it's, it's discontinued. Yeah, discontinued. Yeah. But when was it discontinued? Because that could be the answer. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I believe 2001, 2002, around about that time. Yeah, but still, like, it's fucking... But that was triangular in shape. But do you this believe, do, 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 waffle, do you believe, do you believe, believe obviously, it. that uh, people, anyone could be re- reborn? Jesus, supposedly, you know what? was being the, the, re- uh, you know, no, no offence to, obviously, the, the Hindu faith, but a lot of them believe that we incarnate into a cow. Buddhist. In all honesty. In all honesty. Buddhists also think re- believe in reincarnation. What, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Buddhists as well. Oh, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. but not into a cow. I mean, yeah, but like, as in, yeah, actual, the Buddha believes, depending on how well or how bad or good you are in your previous life, it's going to determine what you turn into in your next life. Do you think all the cows in the world are just previous Hindus? Basically, pricks. That's what they are. Because <laughs> <laughs> they, they idolized the cows. Like, I remember in Bangladesh, there was a Hindu district, like, well, an area where it was dominated by Hindus. Mm-hmm. Um, and back in Bangladesh, they used to, like, obviously slaughter the cows and obviously give it to the world. What are you laughing for? <laughs> carry on. Okay, let me carry on. Um, and they used to give, um, obviously, to, to the local, um, to, the, uh, to the poor people. So They do that for Ramadan, don't they? Yeah, they do it for Ramadan. But when I always go to Bangladesh, we used to always do it as a sacrifice. To, to obviously give back to the poor, yeah. but in this Hindu district, they idolize it. So when they see someone like myself or my or my dad or my my uncle go around taking these cows, knocking them down, killing them. What do you mean knocking them down? Where you get punched? <laughs> <them? laughs> yeah. Rocky Balboa. Yeah, like, as in, <laughs> as in, like, grab him, grab him. Like, like, like road kill, basically. Like, just fucking running them over. Did you run? Actually, run it over a cow. As in, like, we hit it on the side and then we just under. <laughs> why? Why didn't you just kill it? Because it runs away. What the fuck? Because what you want us to do, God. what, chase after a cow? <laughs> Isn't it easy? Yeah. You're not stupid. <laughs> so we're going to knock it down yeah, and so then they, they have that like it a, um, slowly. No, no, so we, we hit on the side and then it just... It falls it over. It falls over. And, and then, then you then, slit then, its throat. Yeah, basically. Then we say Allah Akbar yeah. and then... <laughs> we say Allah Akbar. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah we kill then, a cow. Yeah, fuck <laughs> it. The fact of it is that you actually run it over No, first. no, we, we don't actually like... So we knock it aside. Yeah, we just hit on the side so then it... It goes Which like, part goes do you hit? Well, the leg? Or well, I, I, well, I don't know. Well, you just get in a fucking jeep and go. Wait, is this like a normal thing that you no, guys do? No, it's not do? a normal thing. No, no, it's not a normal <laughs> thing. We actually buy it from like, the market. 
Oh, fair. But it's very expensive. So obviously, we do the same. F- we do grow. similar so things. So it's easier to steal one. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm not gonna lie. We bunch do, it, that like, bunch it. So you hey. breed cows. I'm not gonna lie. When I was when I was back in Nigeria, we did similar things as well. Exactly. But the thing is, you, you know, know how no, no, no. you don't hit them over. You actually like tie their legs together. Yeah, that's it. And you actually that's put them it. in the ground, <laughs> and then you dig a hole, and he said a prayer, and he cut the slit the front, and he goes into that hole. You know, This is a bit deep. You know, cod when you're in the car. Execution. No, when you're in a car and then you're driving, you jump out. <laughs> oh, yeah, but my point cow. is the cows are actually very smart they know when they're going to be in danger and they're going to die so when they realize a guy's coming with a machete no 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 no, no. i don't think they do because they're, they're not scared of hindus but no, they're no, scared no, of bengali it worked with james <laughs> yeah it worked with james in his country it yeah what you james. do you tie them up you put them on the ground and you close their eyes with what like one of their ears so they don't see it so you don't say they're praying you slit the throat <laughs> <laughs> what are their ears? I don't i'm not gonna lie <laughs> <Jerry>. <laughs> 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 hey where am i <laughs> Where am I? No, not the cheese factory again. No. You know what? Executing a cow is probably the worst thing I've seen in my life because the blood squirts out, and oh, it makes. Yeah. I, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I'm actually used to it still. And huh? I, I, not to sound peak here, what we then do like the rams and stuff. First, of all, we make them fight each other before we kill them. Like, I'm, I'm not joking. Like you make them fucking hate each other. You guys put best <laughs> friends. I never <laughs> you told me this. You wait, hold on. So what do you guys do? Wait, wait, wait. Hold so basically, like so to get the situation. So basically, three days before. Eid, you, like everyone buys cows and goats and stuff. So All what right. we do is, let's say Iqbal's got around. Are you Muslim? Yeah, I am Muslim. So let's say Iqbal's You're Muslim. Hold on. Did not yeah, know that. Is, Fuck is. right off. Bro, you got a cross on your chest. <laughs> stop trying to expose me. But basically. Hold on, well done. Hold on, you stop trying to expose me. Do you me. actually have a cross on your chest? You've got a cross on I've your got a cross and a crescent on my chest. <laughs> I got both. <laughs> so what are you? Are you half Muslim, half Christian? Basically, <laughs> you're fifty-fifty. I mean, my name is James. I think you're forgetting that. Part. Yeah, he's that's a, why he's when a you said Muslim, earth, I was bro. completely yeah, out. Yeah, it's because my yeah, dad. James dad is isn't a Muslim name. It's just like a normal. Are you a part-time <coughs> Muslim? He's man of part-time man Muslim. Earth, bro. He's Muslim on the weekends. I actually finished reading the Quran. You know? Monday to Friday. A lot of people didn't oh, know. Shit, you know? Really? I didn't even finish. I was supposed to do my Willy Wonka, but I cut. You're more Muslim than me. You're the least Muslim person in this room. Let me tell you that now for free. Anyways, back to that <laughs> ram story. Yeah, so we buy them. Yeah, three days before we kill them. Of course, you know that's that's the standard. But let's say Iqbal's got a ram, and I've got a ram. Yeah, but it's not us buying. It's our dad and stuff buying yeah. it. Yeah, And I'm like, oh, my ram is stronger than yours. Yeah. So what we do is you can't just make them fight. My dad's stronger than your dad. <laughs> <laughs> this one's well, my ram bigger than, than your ram. So wait, what you need to do is you need to instigate the fight. So the way you do it is you have to drag one of their legs backwards. So you have to like drag them and keep dragging them backwards. So the other one catches on. And like I think I right, cool, we're, we're about to get it done. They start hitting each other. The one to turn away first oh, fuck, basically loses. To make it worse, after we kill them, the horns and stuff, we we'll put them in hot water. It can actually make them hollow. And then we stick like sticks in it. And then we start hitting each other with it. So <laughs> whichever one comes out first, this is a tribe. basically loses. So this yeah, exactly. So you, you can Are you guys it. all naked with a little leaf? Why is it a leaf? <laughs> 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 like white dots everywhere, like ah. I said a leaf. You Wait, know, I never understood vine. this. You know, some Nigerians that have slits in the in the thing. Is that the slits from the ram? No, no, it's not. This is like oh. a traditional thing. I was supposed to have one. So my sister's actually got three. Oh, it's shit. like faded now. Apparently, the story was because uh, well, my well, sister's well. got three on each side. It's like a tribal mark, okay, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I was supposed to have one and as soon as they started like my mom just dashed in my nan dashed in and basically said like yeah you shouldn't have one otherwise I could have had like the free ones where it's like a, really? yeah, I'm like not joking proper, like, yeah, yeah it's like pretty bad like I would Shit. definitely not look like stop <laughs> he's half Christian <laughs> let him go he's half Christian yeah, he's yeah. Half it, Christian. it is, it is wow. a bit mad still so yeah that's well, mad. Fair enough. It's a bit mad that you got a cross and crescent on your chest and your mouth. Listen, I, I, I do a lot you of things. You two are confused. You and you are confused. Let me tell you that now. Four <laughs> fucking free. You two are confused. I don't know what's going on because you've been Saudi Arabia and you've been fucking casino more times than I have. <laughs> you, you're a Muslim that's read the Quran while having a cross on your chest. <laughs> You're all right. You're all right. I can't. I can't. Right. I can't. No, I can't, no, I can't, no, I can't right. really. I can't. I'm. Yeah, I'm okay. well, you're Muslim right. as well. The only, on paper. On paper. The only kafir here is this guy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kafir. Oh my god, and you're not. Okay. Did you? Did, 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 you know, can you answer? <laughs> can you? Can you answer this? Just answer yes or no. Yeah, Just answer on. yes or no. 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 People are gonna be watching this. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> Just answer this yes or no. Did you or did you not have bacon in a burger once? Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> did you or did you not? Have... Accident, accidentally. No. Acc- did accident- <laughs> yes. So yes. Wait, wait. So yeah, but accident. No, wait. Did I tell you that this guy had a, had, had a pork dumpling? No, 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 no. <laughs> He's twisting it because no. basically on the menu it, it was said a sausage dumpling. Oh, right, go on. Let me explain. <laughs> no, no, go on, okay. go on, go on. Go on. Yeah, so yeah. we went to New Molden, front yeah. office visit for yeah. work. 
etc cetera, etc cetera. we went yeah, to a yeah, restaurant that yeah, said okay. that sold bento boxes okay. one of the items was the goku uh gyoza gyoza yeah gyoza yeah, yeah, the yeah, little yeah. dumplings it didn't really say exactly what the dumpling was in terms of the ingredients so i told jerry okay cool we got a meal now you try the dumpling tell me what it tastes like yeah he's like brother i don't even know yeah, yeah. <laughs> what do you mean you don't even know i, I don't know i don't know like, yeah, i don't know yeah he said he doesn't but know this guy but what he said next all right cool yeah what was your reaction when you had he's it so, hold on. no wait he didn't bite into it at this point i was waving down the waitress right I no, 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 Fuck I off. literally He's waved lying. down the waitress. Yes, I did. Dickhead, yes, I did. And then goes, <laughs> and I said, I don't know. I don't know what it is. And he goes, there's only one way to find out. <laughs> <laughs> he takes a bite into it before I actually got the lady. And she started coming over and goes, is there pork inside the dumpling? Oink, oink. <laughs> and, then she goes, and then she goes, oh, yeah, it's beef and pork. I was like, oh. my, my question was, did April have any reaction? We actually tasted the, the initial taste. I like, said it tastes like, it it tastes like nothing. nothing. He goes, it tastes like nothing. I was like, it wasn't even good. Exactly. And, and fair enough, he finished the dumpling too. No, you're fucked <laughs> 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 you, know, you know what's mad? This guy's full of shit. Because oh, I wow, literally gave... Mad. I felt like sick after when I heard it was poor. No, he wasn't sick. No, no, did, no, no, did, no, no, did, no, no. Keyword, you, you said after. It wasn't did you, prior. Did you go straight to the mosque and start praying? Oh, uh, no, you, ne- you never see this guy in the mosque. <laughs> Don't even... <laughs> oh, my. Uh, <laughs> may Allah forgive me. But, okay, so let's, let's get back to the topic because... Um, uh, at hand, so he's making all these predictions. He's actually a certified genius, from what I can read. None of you really answered the question in terms of can someone be reborn. Does anyone believe in terms of they can be born again? They can come back. No, uh, I, don't, I don't think it's possible. You don't think it's honesty. possible. So, well, where do you think you go once you're once you're dead? Well, in my religion, in Islam, uh, we believe that there is a hereafter. Obviously, our soul is. Why are you cracking up? You're Muslim yourself. I'm not, not saying laughing. shit. I'm waiting you're for you to paro, bro. Trust me, this guy with a paro. This guy, man, smoking baby. So basically, you're. Friends and family. He's joking. Okay. Okay. Wrap it up, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we believe that our soul is basically transported to the hereafter, which we believe is either heaven or hell. Okay. Depending cool. on obviously what we've done in our in yeah. our life in this. Dunya, so do you think you're going to go heaven or hell due, due to your current situation? If you so die right in now, my opinion, I'll see you, you and you in hell. <laughs> yeah. What about um, you? I'll see myself there as well. I'll be probably in the top elevator. Save um, me a seat. <laughs> yeah, basically I'll save you guys a seat, don't worry. Um, so yeah, so we believe that our soul is taken to the hereafter and we'll obviously live our best life there. Mm-hmm. Okay, fine. Do you think hell will be lit though? I, mean, um, I reckon all the fun people will be there. Yeah. I reckon all the fun people I don't think it sounds lit. Right? I don't think it's going to be lit at all. <laughs> no, you man. But hold on. Okay, okay. So you, believe, you believe that there's a heaven and hell afterwards. Jerry, what, what do you believe happens when you die? <sighs> oh, my God. I, I grew up with Roman Catholic parents. So, yes, you go to heaven, don't you? you go mm. to heaven, go to hell. It's one of the two. Mm. But James? Look, I mean, well, depends. yeah. I mean, the thing is, yeah. I believe in because I studied Buddhism for a little bit as well. So <laughs> you are one kind of like all religions. Guy. Listen, it's not about I'm a Muslim. I've got a cross on my chest. I know about Hindus. Bro. I studied Buddhism. You must have been shoot me down, well, hate me. <laughs> you should live in Hackney. It is who I am. I actually I mess with Buddhism still. I think I think it's, I fuck with Buddha. Yeah, I, 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 I do. I fucked you. I, fuck I, I do you. fuck with the Buddha still, but I, I believe in reincarnation to a certain extent still. But I think ultimately. Once it's all done, okay. Okay, what is a certain extent? Sleep? Actually, good point. Permanent sleep. Because even in Islam, you know, there's judgment there, right? Yeah, like this yeah, but end. our souls are taken, and we're literally where we where, where are we at until Apparently. that day? Apparently. No, no, no. But where are we gonna where are you gonna be until judgment there? Where's your soul gonna be chilling? But we're gonna be in this earth. So That's what, what, what I'm saying. Ghost? Yeah, we're gonna be a ghost, basically. So you believe? Oh, 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 Yes, we have to believe in obviously the good and evil um, angels. <coughs> Not angels, what? Well, good a- well, angels being good and devil as being bad, basically. Of course. Okay. So there's okay, fine. So you believe in a supernatural? To an extent. No, yes. no. So you believe in a supernatural? Oh yes. Okay, okay, yeah. Okay, <laughs> yeah <laughs> so, 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 so therefore, Casper the friendly ghost is going to come through that wall right now. So you believe in ghosts? So let's get on to this. this is a good. It's a good tie-in actually with regards to. The, the utter shit from the article and the guy believing he's going to be reborn <laughs> and apparently the, the, the key to the sphinx is behind one of the guy's ears. So you believe in, in ghosts? Now, let me just go around the room. Um, Do you believe in ghosts? It's a difficult one because... I, 
religiously, I I do have to believe it to an extent. Okay. But I haven't seen any in my okay. time of, of being alive. Fair How enough. are you supposed to see a ghost though? What do you mean? That's the whole point. You're as in like to... a, a like a supernatural being, as in mm-hmm. something there that's not meant but to be. Let's there. leave. Let's leave your obligation to religion and what you're supposed to believe. Okay. Do you personally believe that ghosts exist? Yeah. To an extent, yes. Yes. Okay, so you believe. believe. Do you believe? I, I believe in the supernatural, yes. Do you believe in ghosts? I believe in ghosts, too. Do you believe in ghosts? I mean, at this point, I have to agree with Jerry. Like, I believe in supernatural stuff, so yeah. But, but ghosts. They got ghosts. Ghosts, ghosts are do, part do, do of you like. you believe in ghosts? No. Yeah, no, but no, what's no. Your Body doesn't believe in anything, so, so <laughs> there's no point so, asking. So, what, what would. Uh, fine. So, so uh, if you ask me what happens when you, when you die. You believe we just go into ash and dirt and we just. And then you just. It's a black. Permanent sleep. Permanent sleep. Okay. Zero. You're, you are worm food. Okay, what do you define as a ghost? As in a, a spirit? So, the common definition of a ghost or how people perceive it is someone who has died and they roam around people's homes, people's... Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, and it's usually from like 50, there. 60 years ago. <laughs> you know, I've never met a recent ghost, someone who died, let's say... Um, so someone who died last year. Oh, do you see the? Do you remember? Do you remember, do you remember Tom? Yeah, <laughs> he's only back. Yeah, Steve. He's, he's st- upstairs in the air. He's upstairs. <laughs> he's upstairs. The fucking uh, keep it down, you can. No, exactly. Yeah, but it's, have you been to like these haunted houses and that? Like that sounds no. bare creepy. Yeah, but let's say mm. let's say we it's fucking confirmed one hundred percent that ghosts don't exist. Which for me it is. I wouldn't go into a haunt the, uh, an abandoned house anyway. I don't care where it is. It could be in the middle of center of Dubai. If it's abandoned, what's the point of me being there? But people go there in, in the hills, in the mountains, <gasps> with some abandoned house. Oh my god. This what? leads me on to when I was in Saudi Arabia. There was this place called oh, Jin Valley. Jin? No. Jin that Valley. Does, that doesn't sound good at all. Wait, 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 it, you know what? Yeah, I, I was, you bad. know what? It was mad. Even there he's chasing Jin. Yeah, it sounds good. <laughs> Basically, it's this place the gin where you, bro. you yeah, put the car on neutral and the car will drive itself. I've witnessed it. I've witnessed it myself. Oh, here we the go. The car was going 20 miles an hour. People were literally getting out of the cars, putting a water bottle in the middle of the road, and the bloody water bottle was going left Was it right. down? Was it down a steep hill? It wasn't. It was a straight, <laughs> flat-out road. What's this called? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look into this, because I don't believe in, that shit. Type in Gin Valley, Gin Saudi Valley. Arabia. That's cool. what ties in with the um, Bermuda Triangle as well. Do you know about that? Like when the planes try oh, to fly over it and they never just disappear. Yeah. 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 Different world, different dimension, they just get lost. Yeah. But, oh, that's how, what it is. but how do you explain that? How does a plane mm-hmm. disappear on yeah, site the, and doesn't reappear? That's true. That's like that. What, what happened with that Singapore um, Well, people plane. say, well, it's a similar situation, though. No? Disappeared, just went. Disappeared. Yeah. Well, they the couldn't fuck? find the remains of the plane. Yeah, that's true. But no the black black to be fair, where, like where, where where it landed, because if it's in some remote part of the sea, you know, it it may be a bit more difficult. Yeah, that's to, what's to, fucked. To get out and there. the thing is, we haven't even explored the sea that well. Do you know how yeah, many times we try to go yeah, deep, yeah, deep yeah, there in the is, sea? And yeah. that is like oh, yeah, weird fair. shit down there. Mate, it's just rare having bits of land. That's what is majority of it is is the ocean. Yeah. Well, but that kid could be right. There could be a global catastrophe. Yeah, but, but, the thing yeah, but hold on, but I, hold on. I'm not a genius. No I may be a comedy genius, but I'm not no, a genius. Never been really I can not say, a comedy genius. But I can say I can say anything. <laughs> oh my god! I reckon in five years' time, there's going to be some kind of disaster that happens in the world. Yeah, I can say the most it's biggest shit anyway. That, well, people believe it's either the climate catastrophe or World War Three. One of the two. World War Three. Well, the climate thing know, is a very, yeah. very popular topic yeah, at the moment. That's definitely. Like it is happening. Yeah, like it's fucked. Yeah, it's we're, fucked. We're, yeah. You like, can't shout. Global warming is fucking real, man. It's bad because Bangladesh won't exist in the next probably thirty to fifty years. Well, we're hoping. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, Philippines is overpopulated, so yeah, we're fucked. Yeah, Kosovo has remained I, in, in, in the lie. same situation it was twenty years ago. They <laughs> just, haven't fucking evolved. Just, just humble and <laughs> discovered the wheel. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> the other thing that's quite interesting. Not even that, yeah, bro. It's still square wheels. It's still square wheels. Bro. <laughs> the <laughs> other thing that's quite interesting. When I first came into this country, like when I was like what 10, 12 years ago, oh, yeah, there used to be snow there. every Christmas. Like December time is a guaranteed snow. Very oh, excited to see it. Yeah, exactly. I, oh, I can't remember the last time I saw snow during Christmas period. Like it's been like many years now. Yeah, it's true. Like, yeah, it's fucked. It, yeah, it yeah. barely fucking snows anymore. Like when we're in summer, when it's supposed to be summer here, it's not. Like, Bro, it's, you get like three, wev- like three different weathers yeah. in one day. Like That's, it's mad. <laughs> that definitely says something. Yeah, that is. Because remember when you're growing up, when you are a child, there was literally... Like distinct predictable yeah, distinct patterns to the weather seasons yeah yeah summer mm. winter autumn spring it was distinct it was guaranteed yeah right? because the last two days it was 
fairly average web design. It was quite nice. It was human. Uh, I mean, we're, we're analysing a few years telling me in the last two days. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no, when, when you're growing up, when you're, when you're a child, it was distinct, right? Yeah, it was. It was distinct. If it was winter, it was fucking cold. Fine, there was no fucking hints of sunshine or wherever it is. When it's spring, it was mediocre. Summer mm. was hot. Yeah. For sure, you can be out playing yeah. with your friends when you're young. And then autumn, you literally seen the fucking leaves change. Leaves change. change. Yeah, yeah. You've literally seen it. Yeah, and it wasn't mad. raining. It's, it's fucked. And, nobody, and nobody. now you just have no idea. Yeah. yeah. Apple, Apple weather. Or, well, yeah, BBC weather. Massive That's basically Apple weather. <laughs> <weather, you know. laughs> Apple weather. Yeah, but he, he, he is right. Well, I think that concludes our, our conversation for today. Yeah. Um, that's about it from the BJ uh, report on, on on this episode. Thank you both both guests, James, oh, thanks, Iqbal, for thank you, thank you yeah. for Just coming. <laughs> you know, and hopefully we can have you back. We've had you on too many times. <laughs> oh yeah, so, yeah, yeah. You <laughs> you've got, you've got, you've got some praying to do. <laughs> <laughs> get back Repent. in the dean, bro. Yeah, get back in the dean, man. I need to. And please, guys, um, follow us on Instagram. Uh, our Twitter, the, sorry, our yeah, Instagram, Instagram handle has changed. Just the BJ Report. It's just at the BJ Report now. There's yeah. no underscore uh, the BJ Report. Oh, yeah, Report. Big, what's their names? Two oh. Canadian girls. No, American girls. American, yeah. Wow, Jerry. Wow. Uh, <laughs> 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 they, 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 they love sex. Boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, so we, we had, dirty, we, we had like a bit of a competitor. Proper. Um, <laughs> who, whose name was the BJ Report who started off at the same time oh, as really? us okay. but they only had one or two episodes and we flustered to yeah. well, we moved forward to about 15 and they decided to, to, to change their name so yeah. we got that Instagram handle we so it's, it's, I'm podcast. just quite interested I mean is it a different kind of BJ Report they're reporting there, there was yeah, <laughs> yeah no, literally, that, no but there's is sex it, and shit yeah, yeah that's oh, what I was oh, thinking really? that's literally what I've got in mind yeah. BJ uh, Report you know Oh my like, God! There's another BJ report. It's called <laughs> Party and Jericho. Party and Jericho, but no, no, but but no. They, I, a little did, collab might be good. No, exactly. So yeah, they, yeah. we did, we did reach out. We they're did speak to, to them, it. and they're happy to do a collaboration. Oh, really? I, I think yeah, I think yeah, it'll be a different oh. kind of video, guys. So let's just be no. careful. <laughs> no, are they, no, are no, they no, both no. single? Um, they're, they're best friends from what? From, young? from, 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 from when from they were. Young. Young. How old are they? Are they? Like, Why do you care? Gothic shit, man. I don't know that much about the. No, no, I went. I'll tell you. They went on today. I went onto the Instagram. Right, I was like, fucking hell. They're like into some proper gothic shit. When you mean yeah. gothic, as in like, like, like fucking like dress tie, up, tie you up, like blood, whip you. Yeah. All I can say is the interaction <laughs> I had with them was very pleasant, no, and they were nice. very, very yeah, open. Yeah, I'm sure person. they are really nice. You, to, you told me they're very nice, but when I had a look on the Insta, I was just saying like proper. The Sid Insta. Yeah, well, we'll, we'll show. We'll show. We'll show but you. It'll be nice to actually let to, uh, to to get to know them and do have them on a podcast for Ab sure. Absolutely. Hundred percent. Absolutely. So if you days to get excited. Look at his fucking. Yeah. Well, one girl's like, one of them's tatted as well. So you, Wee, like that. you got to charge your single as well, right? Jerry, you're just as tatted as me. I don't know where you are. <laughs> I, I hide mine very well. Moana here. Huh? <laughs> 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 Mr. Maui. Fair enough. But well, yeah, please, please do follow us um, on Instagram at the BJ report, yep. share uh, as much as you can. And let's get this content out, uh, you know, and start getting, reaching out new listeners. If you do want to be on the show, please reach out to Let us. Um, contact at the BJ report.com. You can also send us an email or send us a direct message on Instagram. Thank you very much for listening. Thank you much for the guest. Thanks thank for having me. Boys, uh, man, I'm here, bro. Absolutely. <laughs> well, ventured. thank you guys and take care until next time. Big up. Bye bye. Ciao for now. I'm gonna go get some more.